dudes and dudettes of YouTube land. It's Frank with What's the Point EDC. Y'all know what time it is. It's time for a fruit cut video. A, fruit, uh, a food processing video. Sorry about the lighting. I, I put a 5,000 watt bulb up there. Uh, I might show it to you guys at the end of the video. It's hilarious. You guys can probably hear the fan in that thing running going, yeah, because it's so freaking strong and gets so hot. So today we're going to be cutting up a few different foods. Um, we're going to do some lemons, some limes. We're going to do some pineapple, probably some onions. Shoot, we might even do some meat. All right, so what we got here is 1095 high carbon steel. This is the SE Laser Strike. This is a bushcraft slash survival um, knife. I'm gonna go ahead and call it survival for sure. It can do bushcraft tasks. This is a do it all knife in fact, but it's it's a survival knife. Inside of these scales right here, there is a, uh, there's a striker, uh, spark striker, I forget what you call it, a ferro rod, and uh, some form of like cotton or something up inside there. So you guys can uh, start fires if necessary. So it does have a 90 degree spine. It's got a really good jimping right here. These scales are micarta. You have a drill uh, divot right here for fires, you know, so you guys can start fires. I'm not really good at the fire thing, to be totally honest. So uh, it's not my thing. Although I'm working on it. I'm learning, guys. Don't, <laughs> don't think I'm not. So I, I really like the jimping. It's good for placement of your hands. I don't, I don't have any specs on this. This is not a review. This is just me enjoying this knife. And uh, right here's some blood, actually. It's uh, not new, it's months old. I got myself real good right there. It was good and deep, trust and believe me on that. <clears throat> All right, today we're gonna go ahead and get started. Get that monster in your life. But we're gonna, just gonna go ahead and cut a pineapple real quick and see what it's doing. I don't really care about any messes or anything. It's not what I care about. I'll clean that up later. Okay, how we want to do this? Let's just cut it like this. Hope everybody's getting a good visual. What's everybody carrying today? Today I'm carrying my SE Laser Strike, Best Techman Ronin, and a Off Grid Baby Rhino. My flashlight that I'm carrying is the same one as always. It's going to be the Rogue Yvonne Aurora A2 Gen 3. It's got five functions in total. It's got a USB charger. It's got a magnetic pocket clip and it's good to go. <laughs> so this is on the factory edge still. It's got no issue cutting whatsoever. Uh, so it has a really nice thick spine. That's a full tang that runs all the way down. But what it does is it's got a flat grind and right here where it goes, it just, I guess it's flat. It feels pretty daggone flat to me guys. Um, it just gets down to a, a really good edge that's not too thick, but it's not so thin that when you're out doing survival things or in the bush, that you're not gonna break the edge and damage it. So it's good to go as far as that is. Let's see here if I hold it like this. Oh, that, this is so sharp. I've done all kinds of videos with this already, as far as like shorts. But the big thing is, is I went out and I've used it so much and already done tests with it that I haven't gotten on camera. So it's, it's unfair to uh, say that this is at its best. So just so you guys know, this is not its sharpest. It's not, it's on the factory edge, but it is not factory sharp still. It's so sharp still that I, I want to make sure that that's uh, something I get through. It's very sharp still. So we'll just do something with this and this. We'll go ahead and slice these up a couple just to get a good little feel for the knife because I'm going to make a little something something out of this. You know, I might even make a video out of that, so I'm not going to say what this is. It might be part number two coming up. Y'all don't even know. I got a lot in store for you guys. Sure do. I guess that's a small knife. I ain't going to work like a chef knife. So I have no problems with the grip at all. It's doing what it should do. Let's run it down like this. Whoa, whoa, watch out, guys. Chop! <laughs> Couple skinny ones. Let's get it a little bit more intricate, a little bit. See if we can get a couple. Of, oh, there's the dog. He heard something. He, I don't know what he heard that got his interest, but he heard it. 
sell. I don't know if anybody out there owns a, a laser strike. Uh, but if you don't, I fully suggest go ahead and get one. You can't go wrong with this. It's got a really good, um, it's almost like a choil right here. Let me show you guys. You see, I'm talking, it, you can choke way up. You see, it's, it's just excellent. The weight of the knife, got good weight. Good to go. Uh, let's keep on doing. We're gonna finish this up. It's gonna be probably a little bit of a longer video. It's probably gonna be like 12, maybe 15 minutes. But you guys say that you like longer videos that I do, so if you guys want, I'm gonna give it to you. I hope everybody's having a good Monday. It's my card on Monday. Here's my micarta. I forgot to do a short on this. I don't know why I'm cutting this up so weirdly. I need to be taking them other parts out. So now I gotta cut all of all of this right here. Me not paying attention to what I'm doing. But that's okay. No big deal. It's a small thing to a giant. Okay, got a couple more of these to go. I'm just gonna go ahead and get through them real quick. They don't need to look good. They don't need to be the same size. They don't even need to really do anything special. It's pretty much, this is just for food demonstration purposes. <clears throat> this can 100% be a good camp knife. As you guys can see, this 1095 stays sharp because it's got a really good heat treat. It's got the Rowan heat treatment. You guys know what time it is with the Rowan heat treatment. Everybody knows about that. This one last piece, thank God. I'm about tired of messing with pineapple already. Uh -huh. Who else likes to eat it though? The pineapple's amazing. I gotta get me some real quick. Mm -hmm. That's good. I'm gonna leave these long strips. That's what I was supposed to do was leave them long in the first place. Mm, lip smacking good. On to the next one. Now I'm just gonna wash this my cart off when I'm done. It's no big deal. That's what this knife is meant to do, guys. Look at that. Good to go. I'm gonna put these on something different real quick. All right, this is what we're gonna put them in. I'm put my lemons and my limes in there. Yeah, it's, it's cutting excellent, guys. There's no problems with this right here at all. The blade edge geometry is good. The heat treatment's good. The steel itself is good. The ergonomics is good. There's nothing that's not good about this knife. Let's go ahead. Hiya! Whoop! Hiya! I guess I should have put some extra pressure behind it. I don't want to squish them up though, like mush them. I guess it doesn't really matter. Okay. Let me rinse this cutting board off real quick and grab us an onion. Give it just a second. Shouldn't be much longer. Now we're going to go ahead and end this bad boy. There's going to be no editing. I was told, actually, I've been told by a couple people that they enjoy it with no editing. It's what they say. So, I'm happy to not have to edit. Because I don't know how, I don't have editing software. I can, and I will. Very soon. Soon, Daniel son. Soon, Daniel son. So this is going to be a little bit more of a finer task. You know? Let me press the knife real quick. I guess this, yeah, this, this right here would definitely be a more, more fine task, you could say. Go ahead and get a small, like, slight dicage. Let's get the head off of there. Leave him like that. I'm going to come over here and do the same. I'm going to come right here. here I'm gonna do them like this see what it feels like I think this isn't this doesn't have like a really rounded belly to it so it's not the best for for going like you know what I mean like you be dice and dice and you know what I mean I mean we can do some dicey dicey yeah I mean it works good can you guys see that let's give you a little dicey dice let's just say this right here was our uh, our garlic you know You guys can see it'll work. It has no problem putting.
putting the work in on finer tasks. It's a good knife, guys. I 100% suggest it. This is the SE Laser Strike. Great knife, good steel, good heat treatment, excellent ergonomics. The best, probably the best warranty in the game. All right, everybody, this is Frank with What's the Point EDC. If you're an addict, never quit quitting. If you're struggling with bad thoughts, please reach out. Help us closer than you think it is. This is not how it ends, but how it begins. Much love. Stay easy, stay greasy, and stay cheesy. Good vibes and sharp knives. Frank out.